I'm here, people. I'm here. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's AJ. So right now, I want to talk about some more TNA releases. Uh, yesterday, they ended up releasing Festus, a.k.a. DLC and T TNA. Actually, he didn't get released. His contract expired, and they didn't renew it. Now, I'm not sure why they got rid of him, but in my opinion, and I'm not saying this because I have anything against TNA or any of these wrestlers, but if you get released by WWE and then you go to TNA and you get released, you might as well find a new career because there's no point in you going to ROH and all these little companies because you're not going to make a lot of money. So I would suggest finding a new career. Like I said, it's not because I don't like them or the organization or anything, but that's just the way I feel. The second person that they released was Tara in WWE. She was Victoria. And in my personal opinion, I think she was one of the top um, divas, even in WWE. I don't know why they got rid of her. Actually, I think she left. I'm not sure. But she was one of the top divas. She was actually a pretty good female wrestler. And I'm so very surprised that TNA got rid of her. And the reason that they say they got rid of her was because she was one of the she was the highest paid diva in TNA. Now I can understand that she is getting kind of old, but she was still a really good female wrestler. So I don't know what's up with that. But I guess again, it's just because of the budget cuts. But anyways, let me know what you guys think about that. Um, check out my other videos. Subscribe to my channel if you like my videos. And until next time, peace. Bye. Fucking TNA. They want to let go of all the superstars, people. They want to let them go. I wish them well in their future endeavors, people. Their future endeavors.